Hello friends, my name is Kishan and welcome you in this video tutorial. Uh, this is the continuation of my previous video tutorial. There we have learned how to select multiple values using uh, criteria query in, query in Hibernate file. So this is the code which we had written in our previous video tutorial. So if you did not watch my previous video tutorial then I request you to go and watch my previous video then come to watch this video. In previous video we have written this code so initially using session we called a get criteria builder and we got the criteria builder object and uh, uh, we called a uh, create query on builder object and uh, telling that we want the uh, object array as a output to this criteria query and criteria query is having a method is called from so there we have a specify our root entity and that gives us the root of uh, entity right and uh, using this root uh, we have told to uh, we are telling uh, what are the attributes we are interested to select so uh, this gives us the path right path for every attribute and these paths uh, we have passed to the uh, array method of uh, builder criteria builder uh, so if you look into the uh, uh, input of uh, uh, array method that's the object array and with this object array we have passed over here and uh, we call uh, create query on uh, session and we are passing this uh, query which we have built here right which, which will here and this criteria very well know what is our uh, what is the our output what is the root entity and what are the attributes we are we, we, we want to select everything know this criteria right and this criteria we are passing the passing to the create query method and this create query returns us the query of object array and we call list method on it and this gives us the object uh, list of object array and just we have iterated and we got the uh, response uh, so zeroth in uh, index will will on zeroth index will get the employee name first index will get the employee uh, employee uh, email address and third index will get the uh, employee salary and uh, we have retrieved from every index uh, corresponding uh, attributes and we have type casted into the corresponding data type and that's the way to retrieve uh, multiple uh, values in uh, hibernate 5 using criteria query now next thing uh, next approach to select uh, multiple values uh, if you are not uh, interested to use uh, this array then there is another way to do the same so here criteria query instead of using array method of builder criteria builder uh, criteria query is having a method is called multi select so you can see this multi select so multi select is there is an overloaded method so we are going to use the second one which accepts a selection of where arc and here we can pass this uh, list of paths which we are interested to select and that's it we are done so here uh, as i told you in previous video tutorial this is our client program which we have to run right click over here and you can do run as a as java application so this will create a employee table in our database test database and that will that will insert two records something like this and now once you populated the data then you can have a second program there we have used a criteria query to select multiple values right so there is little modification so instead of using array method of criteria builder uh, criteria uh, builder uh, we can use a multi select method of uh, criteria query and there we can pass a list of paths right this access list of selection via where arc and once you modify these things then let's run this program and see whether we get the output or not great now you can see the select query select employee name email and salary from employee table and currently there are uh, two employees right so first employee information like uh, employee name email and salary and for second employee you can see the again name email and salary so as of now we have got only two records and that's the reason uh, we got the uh, information about the 
to employee so this loop will be iterated two times so that's all i wanted to uh, cover in this video tutorial i hope you like this video uh, if you did not subscribe my youtube channel then please subscribe it and this code i am going to upload on the github and github location you will get in the video description itself so thanks for watching this video and see you next video tutorial